2017 Jeep Grand Cherokee with uh, it's a limited with the uh, trail rated package and the quadro lift suspension and I just wanted to show you I got some new tires on and a lot of people said that they wouldn't fit um, so I bought the Aturos uh, 285 60 R18 um, they're on a an 18 inch rim with uh, 9 inch width and um, the offset is 12. I just want to show you this. This is in park mode, which you would never drive in, obviously. And you can see that there's hardly any room at all. So you, if you back up or move forward too quickly without raising it, you will rub. Um, let me show you the other side here. See how close it is. Um, I'm gonna raise it up from park mode so you can see what it does um, as far as the rears go. They're fine, they don't rub at all. So it's just the front that you have to worry about. Okay, so now I've raised it to level one, which is what you would drive in normally. And as you can see, uh, in the front, I still have some issues when I turn the tire full. It still rubs just a little bit there, as well as in the back. And what I've done here, there's a piece of metal I don't know if you can see that was here. I actually bent it back, put a slit here, and pulled this back. So I'm getting an extra inch. Now that I've done that, it's, it doesn't rub in the back here anymore. Um, so I'm just worried about the front a little bit, and that's at full tilt uh, when I crank it fully. Um, so I'll show you driver, I mean off-road mode one, and then you can see the difference. Okay, so that's off-road one. And as you can see, now I now have enough clearance. I can fully crank the front and the back. Uh, so, sorry, the front fully and not have to rub either the front or back. And uh, it seems to work good. The only thing is when I'm driving on the highway, it automatically goes down to aero mode, which lowers it. And I'm okay with that because I'm not cranking the steering wheel. But as soon as I get off the highway, I have to raise it up again. Um, I have found a video on YouTube that I can change this thing right here. I don't know if you can see it. So I'm gonna change this thing. This is the sensor for the ride height. And I'm going to put a threaded rod, take these off, put it back on, and just shrink it just a slight bit. What it does, if I shrink it, it'll automatically keep this ride height uh, higher in the front. And that should solve my problem. And uh, I wanna do that anyways because what uh, Chrysler Jeep does is in the front it's always been lower anyways and I don't like that look when I'm I want it to be level so I'm gonna be fixing that and uh, putting some different fender flares on here but uh, that's my 2017 Jeep Grand Cherokee limited uh, trail rated with the off-road package and like I said with the, the larger tires uh, just for to show you, I'm going to raise it up to the off-road too, so you can see the ride height, and uh, that one obviously has no problems whatsoever. One sec. Okay, so that's off-road two. Obviously, that gives it the best stance, best look that I like, and uh, if I could stick with that look, that's what I would do. Um, And that's my, uh, again, my 2017 Jeep Grand Cherokee Limited with the off-road package and uh, tow, tow package as well. Has the hitch in the back here. Um, but yeah, that's, that's it. Thanks for watching.